sets to see Roll. Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Far Experience. So last video I showed you the India Gate which is situated in India and today we are in the capital of the United States, Washington DC and I'm gonna sh show you guys how lit National Harbor is. So today we are at the National Harbor. Mind it guys, I bring you the real life raw experiences and that's why our channel is the far experience from all over the world. Anyway, so without wasting time, today we are heading to National Harbor and we are exploring. It's one of the most vibrant destinations just outside Washington DC, National Harbor, Maryland. And whether you are into waterfront views, fantastic dining or family fun, this National Harbor is actually meant for everyone. Let's dive in and discover what makes this place so special. Alright, the first thing guys, make sure, you know, parking is a pain here. So, when you come to the National Harbor, ensure, you know, you have reserved your parking using apps like Spot Hero or something. Or else there are a garage, a couple of garage there too, where you can get your parking. So the first thing when you are into the National Harbor is absolutely dining. When it comes to dining, National Harbor has a diverse range of options. It has got like from upscale restaurants to even casual eateries. You'll find something to satisfy, you know, whatever your need is. And don't forget to check out the eateries at the wharf which offers everything from seafood to international cuisines. But make sure I'm not gonna cover the wharf today. Maybe I'm gonna cover the wharf some other day. So let's just stick to National Harbor today. And the next thing in line is for shopping enthusiasts. Like this area is filled with boutique shops and retail outlets. So whether you are looking for unique souvenirs or latest fashion trends, you are gonna find everything out there. All right, the next thing in line is National Harbor is also known for its lively entertainment scene. There's always something happening from concerts or festival to art shows, seasonal events. So keep an eye on the local calendar to catch live music or special celebration. I just missed it. I think when I reached there, the performance was over, but yeah, that's okay. So right now, if you can see on the screen, that's the Air Force Band. That and they are actually playing out. Play, they were playing out there. Indeed, I missed it, but yeah, salute to them. Uh, minded guys, we do have the MGM National Harbor, uh, the resort and casino, which is actually world renowned. Everybody knows about it, about its luxury accommodation, fine dining, and world class entertainment. It's a perfect spot for night out. So, again, I'm not gonna cover. Um, MGM today but I'll try and cover in the future videos so I have got the war for an MGM on my bucket list and here it is the beautiful sunset so that's the reason why we need to make ensure that while we are visiting the National Harbor we need to be here around the evening and that's the mesmerizing sunset you could ever see anywhere So the structure is called the Awakening since 1980 and this is a 72 feet statue by A. Seward Johnson Jr. Basically this is five separate aluminium pieces buried in the ground giving an impression of a distressed giant attempting to free himself from the ground. So it is beautiful indeed. So again, as you guys know, National Harbor is also a fantastic destination for families, spacious playground, you know, the public art installation and activities that are fun for all age. And um, mind it guys, if you are going along with your family, be sure to check out the family friendly events or festival happening during your visit because this place is always lit and there's always exciting to do for children and parents. Out there, 
So as I explained to you guys, there are a lot of activities you can do. The water taxi, which is on my mind, but for today, I think uh, I promised my viewers the Capitol wheel. So the Capitol wheel is here, which is actually an iconic representation of Washington D.C. at the Capitol. So. I'm gonna try the capital wheel but before we go ahead this is a beautiful view of you know a sunset and you can even see people are enjoying all their boat rides so I do want to cover this Potomac water taxi but uh, like since it's too late and I think they do have certain timings so the last one was actually right here but then they won't be bring me back to the National Harbor so I had to skip it for today but I'll ensure to cover it you know moving ahead in future but for today as you can see we are moving towards the iconic capital wheel and we are gonna have a ride on that today And mind it guys, I was here today because the Capitol Wheel is celebrating like I think it's 10th anniversary around the Independence Day July 4th. So you can also see, you know, it, it's lit in red, blue and white and it's gonna give us an awesome view. all right so it's about time let's hop on let's get our tickets it's not as expensive it was uh, i think around 10 bucks but anyway so we are gonna get our tickets and we would be celebrating the 10th anniversary of the capital wheel so you can see right now i'm at the capital wheel and this is a beautiful view so that's towards my left is virginia and towards my right is washington dc and maryland so this is facing towards Maryland. So it doesn't really matter if you are a local or a tourist because National Harbor for, from its beautiful waterfronts to its lively entertainment, the crowd, the dining option, it's a destination you won't want to miss. So again, thank you so much for joining us the tour of National Harbor today and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell notification so you never miss on the next adventure. Now before... Now before I end the video, I would certainly like you to have this glimpse of the beautiful Capitol Wheel and a beautiful evening here at the National Harbor so you can see the sun is almost set, the planes flying up in the air and this video is with love from the United States and the capital of the United States, Washington DC. So please stay tuned to my channel, motivate me so I can bring you the experiences from all the different countries I have been. Thank you so much for watching.